with us in studio, but an enormous shout out to Robin, mm -hmm. the woman who schooled you. I know. You she went into this woman's house. She, there not only was in clutter. <laughs> It was, it was a scam, and I loved her. I loved her. She had lessons to teach me. It was great. You found a guru. I know, I know. <laughs> I'm, I'm so, I mean, or a gal room. We're doing one house in America at a time, and all of a sudden, it's like, oh, my God, I can see the end of the line now. Oh, it's wonderful. <laughs> I know. I could see your face light up. You were like, oh, my gosh, she's glowing. I've got a feeling that by the end of the year, I'm not going to have a job. Everyone's, everyone's <laughs> organized their spaces. No, come on. You, you've always got another tip or two for well, us. I've Give got us a, two more I've for the road. Of, look, this whole year, it's been about inexpensive tips, That's right. inexpensive things to get your home organised. And two of the big things that tackle, uh, that challenge people all the time, I'm going to tackle today. Spice drawer is one. Spice drawer is okay. a big one. Pull these out for me. Sure. Give me a hand here. So, everyone has a spice drawer at home where the spices get totally out of control. Now, tons of people order items online these days and this kind of packaging will mm -hmm. often come with your online orders or you can just cut the corners of a carton. So you end up with a couple of pieces of cardboard with this profile. You place them in a drawer like wow. this. Wow. Now, you can duct tape, them, duct tape them in place. I'm not going to do that today. And you see exactly what we're doing. We're placing... You're making a spice wrap. There it is. Mm. Simple like this. So the spices Just will... to give it a little stability, exactly. you can read it. That's exactly it. And your spices will all sit in here. Oops. Very nicely. And I showed you in my house, but I do keep my spices very well organized and alphabetical. Mm. Let's give Rachel a round of applause for that. <laughs> <laughs> so simple, simple, simple. Now the other thing is, let's just get this closed. The other item that challenges everyone is the plastic container drawer. Let's get these out on the countertop. Oh, I know, right? Oh, yes, I know, and Rachel. It's sort of like that mysterious force that takes one of your socks like every wash. What is the deal with having 59 lids and none of the bottom? Exactly. Maps? Okay, so to that point, so exactly, to that point, help me here. The first thing you do, the first thing you do is go through anything that doesn't have a lid, you know exactly what happens to it. Anything no, that doesn't have a bottom. We would put it in the recycling yeah, well, bin. Same thing. Yes. Same thing, in the recycling <laughs> bin. Now then, let's arrange like things together here. Okay. Like this things. is fun, it's like a game. Exactly, here we go. I'm gonna win. I'm gonna win this challenge! Rachel Ray is not that competitive, everyone, in case you hadn't noticed. Then, unbelievable, unbelievable. Then, you okay? You happy? <laughs> then what you do is you grab what might look like a dish drying rack. We've used this yep, in previous we use segments. This all the time on top of the fridge. Exactly. Uh, as a desk organizer for the kids with the school reports. Oh, you have been listening. I'm impressed. Now, here's what you do. Grab one of these guys, and all of the containers will stack and sit really easily in this. The lids then just sit easily like this in the container as well, in, oh. the, um, in the dish rack as well. I know. It's sexy, isn't it? And then open the drawer. Ta-da! And it will sit easily in the drawer. And Beautiful. There you go. Sexy beast. Cost you nothing. Sexy beast. Cost you nothing.